Hey Aquarius, welcome back to the channel. My name is Nelly, aka Owl Tarot, and I'm here to give you guys your weekend reading. We're going to tap into this energy, see what's going on with you guys for this weekend. But before we get started, if you're new to the channel, please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. Click that notification bell so you can be notified when I post a new reading. If you are a returning subscriber, thank you so much for all your love and support. I appreciate every single one of you guys. Alrighty, Aquarius, as you all know, these readings are for Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus signs. These are timeless general love readings, so they may or may not resonate with you. Please take what does, leave the rest behind. Time is fluid, so whenever you find this reading, you are meant to hear it. There is no gender in tarot. Please reverse the rules as need be. Cross watchers, you are always welcome. Guys, don't forget to check your location so you get a better understanding of this energy. And if you want to book a personal reading, the info is in the description box below. Okay, so let's get started with your overall message for the weekend here for Aquarius Universe. Overall message for Aquarius. Okay. In flow state. Did you see that? It's just like everything is mellow, you know? And look at the card. In flow state. In the zone. Loving life. A focus. High frequency. Skill meets challenge. Flotation therapy. You are in a good place right now, Aquarius. You are in an awesome place right now okay a place where everything is just going smoothly for you there couldn't be anything in the world that can come and destroy it at least that's what we think right now and i'm hoping it stays like that okay ah you're in giving and rece receiving mode here everything is energy reciprocity give receive easily to others and yourself random acts of kindness so you are in such a beautiful place right now that you're giving to others and you're receiving from others things are finally working out as you've been wanting them to okay but i'm getting an energy guys that there's somebody on their way back universe archangel spirit angel guides and guardians let's see here you got the empress and the king of cups here you guys may be in a committed relationship right now where there is a lot of love, where there is a lot of loyalty, okay? There is a lot of equal give and take, okay? Everything is just looking perfect in this relationship. Like, you guys are in such a good place with your partner. It's incredible. And whether anyone is coming, the wheel of fortune, whether anything bad is coming towards you or not, it's really not going to make a difference. There is going something that's going to get ready to happen, not necessarily within the connection, but can affect the connection. But I think that you guys are stronger than ever, that you're going to be able to come come through that right now. But there is something getting ready to happen with the Wheel of Fortune in the reverse. Okay. What is this Wheel of Fortune in the reverse? I don't know why I just heard my mother-in-law. Maybe somebody is starting some ruckus. Okay, somebody's starting to talk shit. Maybe you're new to this family and you and your person are in such a good place right now. You're getting to meet the family and somebody doesn't like you. And that's going to cause a wedge in, in the relationship possibly. Because this can be a mother figure. I don't know why. Maybe a sister. Okay, but there's some family members here that may not, may not like you. I'm saying may not be okay with you but at the end of the day your person has love for you okay your person has a lot of love for you like there is an emotional stability here with you and your person but there is people in the outskirts that are talking crap with the hermit in the reverse like they don't how can i put it like a lot of people think that you may be in this person's life for a reason like you're wanting something because you may be dealing with somebody who's financially stable you may be financially stable your own damn self Okay, with the six of coins here, and I'm pretty sure that you are. But people around you are thinking that that you're you're maybe with somebody because of the financial status or the status of the relationship. I don't know why would why that came out, but I just feel like you got some somebody meddling, somebody trying to throw a horseshoe in your guys's good luck and your guys's connection here. Okay, but honestly, with the hermit, I see I see your person not putting any mind to them. They're moving forward with you with this Knight of Cups. You guys are in a good place. Everything is balanced. This person sees a future with you is what I'm hearing. So whoever's in the background talking shit or ch look at sees a future with you. Look at what flew, flew out. The three of wands. This person sees a future with you. Okay. They see you, you guys building together. You guys doing whatever it takes to have this relationship survive regardless of whoever's sitting back here and talking shit. 
okay because you do have somebody that's looking or frowning upon you guys' relationships just oh that's not gonna last oh she ain't his type or he ain't her type or she's just here because of the money or he's just here because of the money what money it's not like you came broke to the situation you have your own but sometimes you got those overprotective mommies they're like damn that bring a lot of burdens you know what i mean and that's what i feel that this person is it's just a negative energy, a negative burden. But unfortunately, if this is this person's mother, you may have to deal with her. But sometimes it's better to agree to disagree. You know what I mean? Just ignore it. That's what I do with my mother-in-law all the time. I'm like, oh, you said something? All I hear is wah, 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 wah. I let it go, okay? Because you're not going to affect me in any way. I don't take you home. You don't pay my bills. And I definitely don't bang your brains out. So whatever you say, whatever comes out of your mouth, I have no, I, don't, I really don't give a shit. And that's the approach that I feel that you guys are going to take is that you are in such a good place right now that anything this person says, shit, even if they look at you cross-eyed to you, it's a beautiful smile. Like right now, you ain't even worried about it, okay? But it's it's a message that just to be, you know, a little bit concerned, not concerned, but at least for you to know that there is somebody here talking shit about you. But overall, your relationship is in a beautiful place where this person wants to build. Look, at it's stable. You have a solid relationship here and there's envious people around you i just heard that you have a solid connection here and there's people around you people that are trying to fuck this connection up and i honestly feel it's somebody that's really really knee deep into the family being a mother figure a sister because sister-in-laws we, we what the fuck can we really say about our brother-in-laws you know what i mean or our sister-in-laws at the end of the day, I feel it's a mother figure, a father figure, a grandmother, a sister, but somebody that holds a lot of weight in the family, okay, um, is being negative. But you guys are stable. You, this is a, a very solid, this is going, this connection is not going to come apart regardless to whatever this mother says. So if you guys were, were wondering if the parent is going to interfere or is this person going to interfere, no. Even if this person tries their freaking hardest to manifest you out of this person's life or even tries any type of magic, it's not going to work. This connection is too freaking strong that all this negativity is not going to touch it. It's like I'm literally picturing a metal box and, and people are throwing rocks in it and you can't get any dents in it. People are trying to bang it and you can't get it to open it's like a safe like one of those atms you could beat the crap out of it till you get tired and there's nothing gonna come out of it that's exactly how solid this relationship is is that anything that anybody says is not gonna affect it in any which way okay it's gonna take a lot and what i mean a lot to fuck this relationship ship up it's gonna take a lot but it's not gonna take this person this person could say whatever they want to say they could throw that mal de ojo you know the evil eye they could they can just sit there and totally trash your name but your person's gonna be like i'm good with her i'm good with him i love them they haven't given me any doubt and i'm not gonna go off your word because your word to me weighs nothing Okay, it doesn't matter to me. I'm in love with this person and I'm building a future with this person and I go home to this person. I don't come home to you. So I feel that you got people that are envious around your guys' connection, but you got a solid connection. This connection is going to places. It's getting to, yeah, it's getting to higher places. You guys are not going to give up on this connection. You do not care what people say about you. Your person does not care if people like you, they don't like you. As long as your person knows who you are and where you come from and where you want to go, this person is never going to give up on this connection ever. And neither are you. This is a solid connection. This connection is is going to last a lifetime is what I heard. There's going to be a lot of victory here between you and this person, okay? A lot of victory, a lot of recognition, a lot of success. And this is, to me, this 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 card signifies that your person loves to post pictures of you and them on social media. And this is how you got these haters looking at you guys, okay? This is why you got a bunch of haters because your person flaunts you all over the place, okay? They make it be known that you guys are together. You make it be known that you guys are together, okay? And people are just creeping on your guys' social media, talking shit. Ah, that's not going to last. Oh, he's going to find somebody better. Oh, he's going to go here. Oh, she's going to go there. Uh-uh. Little do they fucking know this is rock hard, a solid connection. And it ain't going nowhere. It ain't going to go nowhere. The only thing that can rip this connection apart is death itself. 
okay all right guys i hope and pray this reading gave you clarity please don't forget to like share and subscribe click that notification bell and if you want to book a personal reading the info is in the description box below talk to you soon bye